How you guys doing? It's Crazy American Prepper here. And today we're going to talk about a survivor filter. So stay tuned and we'll get with it. We're back guys. Crazy American Prepper here. Today we're going to talk about some gear that was sent to me from Survivor Filter. This is a Survivor Filter L600 model. Um, right now I'd like to thank Mike for sending this out to me uh, to do a review on. Um, this uh, in here you can see the size. So I mean I put both my hands on there and it's just about right. So I mean it feels good got a good amount of weight uh, feels comfortable so uh, all right so this uh, filter right now filters up to 0 0.05 microns um, it weighs about 100 grams the capacity of uh, filtration is 264 gallons or 1,000 liters so that's pretty good too I mean considering when you be using it um, the water flow is 6.76 ounces uh, a minute or 200 milliliters a minute so that's pretty good now I've heard rumors about people saying that, that they're very hard to, to drink out of that the flow is really hard and you have to suck really hard but we'll find out um, here in just a second uh, the material of this casing is made out of ABS uh, and the filter is a carbon filter that's ultra filter medical grade so there's a filter here, filter in here, and filter inside. We'll get to the breakdown uh, here in a minute. But uh, so right now we're going to get straight into it and uh, drink some water straight out, of, straight with the uh, survivor filter. So this will be the first test, drinking it, making it through it, and then uh, testing out the flow. So let's get in this water. Not bad. Water tastes really good. Um, I didn't have any problems sucking into it. I mean, it, the flow seemed pretty good. Um, I think that just might be certain people just have a problem with the flow. But the flow for me was was. Um, I mean, right on for what it is—a survivor filter. So when you buy a survivor filter, they come with two of these uh, collapsible water uh, containers. Uh, they're pretty nifty and pretty good hard plastic but um, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to fill this up uh, and with water and and then we're going to attach it to the survivor filter right here so let me uh but what I want to do is I don't want to just get the top surface of the clean water I want to get some dirty water I want to get the, the nitty-gritty done to this let's find out how much this thing's gonna gonna filter out on me because I may not come across water that's clean like this. It may be really bad water. And so you need to know. And right now you'll know. And if it does this very, very good or well, then uh, then you'll know that the, the cleaner water would be best for it. So let's blow into it and see if we can get some water in here. hard I right, got some water in there I hope you guys can see that it's discolored uh, let's see see how discolored that water is let's see if we can get it clear is we're going to attach the bottom of the filter to the, to the bag. There it is. Hope you guys can see that. I'm going to 
put it inside this bottle, water bottle. So how I'm gonna do it is that you can gravity feed it, just hang it. Um, I'm gonna force it. Ah, oh, there we go. Little squeeze and out comes the water. That seems to flow really good. Again, no problems with the flow. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Set that right here. I'll hold it right here so you guys don't think it's TV magic and I put another bottle in here. But, uh, Huh. Oh yeah, that's some good dirty water. So that worked out good. Let's cap this off and uh, taste good too. Man, I can't believe how good that water tastes out of there. I hope you guys saw that bottle sitting there. Um, I did not change the water. It's this is what it just did. Good old clean water. Uh, let's see if I can... <clears throat> wow, that is very good water. Look at the difference in that water. And it just changed it. So, totally cleaned it, filtered it out. I mean, excellent, excellent job. Wow. I mean, look how clear that water is. I don't, I hope you guys can see how clear that is. That is clear. Amazing, simply amazing. Now, you're done getting all the water you need. Put the cap that comes with it, clip it to your belt, or get more water. Put your cap on or clip it to your belt. Put this bad boy back in your pocket and you're good to go for another adventure uh this is a 32 ounce pouch by the way so you can get 32 ounces of fluid in here and uh that'll keep you going uh the flow is was was awesome was perfect um i see no problem with this and uh the water as you can see it does the job so Let's move over here and we'll talk about the, uh, we'll break this thing down and get to looking at the filters individually. And we're back to do the breakdown of the Survivor filter. Um, so as you just saw, it filters murky water really good. It got me really excited to see such a good product, clean, dirty water like that. And it tasted awesome. I wish you guys could taste it. Well, actually you can. Uh, just click on the link below. It takes you straight to survivorfilter.com. And order your own yeah i think it's 30 dollars so but first let's get to the components the first component we're going to get to are the the ultra filter and the ultra filter is at the bottom of the filter and oh yeah lots of water in there from just using it there's this little mesh filter in here uh or i'm sorry not the ultra filter this is the mesh filter uh the mesh filter as you can see we just used it so it's nice and dirty Clean it off and we'll use it again. Uh, but when you order the survivor filter, it does come with some extra mesh filters. So there's that. The next piece we're going to take off will be, well, here's the cap. And the cap is just held on by a little piece of some rubber. And uh, we'll just take the cap off. And to remove this part, which is the carbon, or I'm sorry, yeah, the carbon filter, you just give it a little twist and pull it right out. And there it is that's the carbon filter so and uh, again this part is replaceable uh, you can order another one on their site uh, the next thing is the ultra filter and to get to the ultra filter you push on the bottom of the filter and it pops out they have a little screen that helps protect it and just lay that right there Take that filter out. 
and then all you're left with is the insides. Now here's the filter. But you guys can see that it's like a thousand little straws in there, all mixed up in there. I know you guys aren't gonna be able to see that, but there's a bunch and it looks like rubber bands on the other end and it's really cool but that's pretty much it of the filter um, it's got three main components and each all three of these components are, are replaceable so uh, you don't have to worry about stupid wasp uh, so you don't have to worry about once it goes bad uh, throwing it away and spending another thirty dollars now you can go on their website and get them I think that most of their parts or replacement parts are around ten dollars each so um, these you shouldn't have to ever hardly replace. Or these would be the most common item to replace. But like I said, that when you buy it, they come with like ten of them. So you're already ten ahead on the mesh filter. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it back together. Oh, let's don't forget to put the cap back on, or the little mesh screen they had there. Oh no. And it does have a little seal on, a rubber seal on there, so when you put it on, it's wrong side. It goes on like that. Got a little confusing. And then you just put the top back on. And there that is. The mesh filter is right there. It goes in the bottom. And uh, voila, there it is. Oh, and you got the cap. But, and also, again, it comes with the 32 ounce bag. So it's a great deal. I'd like to thank Mike for sending this out to me. Uh, this was an awesome review. I love this thing. Um, I'm going to order one now for myself. And uh, that way I just have more of them. Uh, these will be a, a, a good gift to give somebody if you really care about their survival in any type of situation. You saw the water tests, um, I, the flow tests, 100% uh, man, accurate. The survival filter is a great filter. Um, it filters down to 0 0.05 microns. I mean, do your research yourself if you don't, if you don't believe me. Uh, that's one of the best on the market. So, uh, and this is coming from a guy who used to be a, a Sawyer Mini water filter guy. Uh, that used to be, I used to stand by that 100% and now Survivor Filter has gained them another fan.